next we are back with another video tutorial today our topic of discussion is interpolation so what is basically interpolation interpolation is nothing but estimating the unknown values using the neighboring known values let's uh, take an example if you are having a region where uh, there are five points which doesn't have data or uh, they have missing data so how you can calculate that so what we will do we will estimate those points on the basis of neighboring known points so basically that's how interpolation work so we have added a India file and you can see that these black regions are the one which is having no data or the missing value so how we can interpret value for this region based on the neighboring values so when we are working with TIFF file um, so it is difficult to directly interpolate uh, this uh, particular file so what we will do we will convert it into XYZ files or CSV uh, basically we are converting it to a point file so that we know that what is the data at each point and then we can interpolate for the points which are missing so how we will convert it so for the very first step go to processing select toolbox once the toolbox will appear search for XYZ and then an option will come as under the raster conversion as JDL to XYZ just open this and it will ask you for the input layer specify your input layer and your band and then just check this box which will produce a CSV and then save your file somewhere because you will be needing it later so we are saving it as interpolation and then press save and then run this process once you will run this process just close it and then add that interpolation CSV file it's this go to delimit it and then here browse and then add your interpolation CSV press open now it will ask you about your if, uh, X field Y field so that it can add the CSV as a point layer so in X field add this in Y field add longitude and if you want you can specify the CRS we are going with the default and then you have to what you have to do just press add and then close once you will press add you can see just keep it below so that you can see it clearly now you can see it has generated a grid of total points with the extent of our India now you have a CSV file now what you have to do you have to interpolate so again in the toolbox just say interpolation and then there will be an option of interpolation that is IDW interpolation inverse distance weighting just double click on this and it will ask you what is your vector layer that is your point layer we have generated it will ask you for the attribute so just select the third Z value which has been generated by the CSV once you will click this just press this plus button so that it will be added here now you have to provide the extent just click on this and select calculate from layer and give your raster India extent and then just run the process once you will run the process will start processing it will take too much time that's why we have added result for you so the result you will get is well this now if you will see that there is no gap in the data you can see these black points here now we are having data for those points as well so basically that's how you perform the interpolation in QGIS and uh, yeah that's it for today thank you